Hello everyone. I am Serdy Katch, a serial killer from Ukraine. My life has been filled with darkness and depravity due to the heinous crimes and sexual assaults I have committed. But today, I am here to share with you my journey from despair and helplessness in the depths of hell to redemption and forgiveness. I was born and raised in darkness. Ruthless desires and crimes quickly engulfed all innocence and love within my soul. I became a monster, selecting victims based on their appearance and carrying out unspeakable acts of horror. Arina Melnichenko, a 16-year-old girl, became my first known victim. In 1984, I kidnapped her and unleashed the cruel world that resided within my dark soul. I had no remorse as I sexually assaulted her, inflicting immense pain and eternal torment. In the end, I mutilated her lifeless body and discarded it in a forest, like a symbol of complete annihilation of hope and innocence. Natalia Buktoyarova, a 14-year-old girl, became my next target in 1985. I abducted her and took her to a secluded area, far away from safety and light. I had no mercy as I sexually assaulted her, turning her into a vulnerable prey in my cruelty. Afterwards, I buried her in an unmarked grave, a place of darkness and profound solitude. Olena Kozhevatova, a 14-year-old girl, fell victim to me in 1985. I sexually assaulted and murdered her in a brutal manner. My dark soul knew no kindness or empathy. I discarded her body into a pond, a place of ultimate guilt and destructive desires. Natalia Kolos, a 16-year-old girl, became one of the unfortunate victims in 1986. I kidnapped her and subjected her to sexual assault, inflicting further pain and despair into her life. I cannot fully describe the gruesome acts I committed. I deceived and kidnapped young girls, torturing and sexually assaulting them until they were defenseless. Then, I mercilessly ended their lives and disposed of their bodies in desolate places. But one day, amidst the darkness of my soul, a flicker of light emerged from within. It was God coming to redeem my soul, awakening the best parts of my humanity. God told me that despite my descent into hell, there was still hope for change and forgiveness. The words of God illuminated my soul from the darkest depths. I felt fortunate to have the opportunity for transformation, to cleanse myself of sin and pursue righteousness. God opened the door of salvation before me and set me on a new path, a path of repentance and reconciliation. I cannot fully express the remorse and regret within my soul. I apologize to each victim I have taken away. From Marina Melnichenko, Natalia Buktoyarova, Olena Kozhevatova, Natalia Kolos, Svetlana Masyuk, Tatyana Rezaychenko to Inna Nazarenko, and all the others whose names I do not know. I also apologize to their families and loved ones. I understand that this apology can never compensate for the loss and pain I have caused. From now on, I want to awaken and warn everyone. Cease your actions of evil and turn back to the right path before it is too late. I pledge that those who refuse to surrender and continue their wicked deeds will face punishment from the very depths of hell. My life now is a journey of repentance and reconciliation. I feel fortunate to have the chance for change and to witness the light of God, trust in His forgiveness and unconditional love.